FMW. I have an amazing surprise for all of you. Okay, the 2006 MacBook. Are you ready? <sighs> yes, it is fixed. This is not a new one. This is the same one. We, 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 um, there was a bit of a, a, a cost involved because uh, I had to swap some inverters and stuff around, but this thing now works and it powers on with its own screen. I, I know, I, I am anti TechMW now. I am not breaking stuff, I am fixing stuff. So let's plug it in. Oh, oh, what is going on? Why is it making that noise? Why? I, okay, we're just gonna, we're just gonna, um, we're just gonna ignore that. Yes, we have also got it running Windows 10. That's right, so today we're gonna try Windows 10 and we're just gonna try running some games, you know, similar stuff to uh, what we did on the 2006 MacBook Pro. What is going on? Why is the web, why is the webcam on? Hello? 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 Hello! It's fine, it's fine. I'm sure we're not being spied on by, uh, I don't, I don't know. I don't know who would be spying, to be honest. Right, so, yeah, long story short, basically, this is basically just using the SSD that we used in the MacBook Pro 2006, so it's the same installed of Windows 10, which is actually a good thing, because it means we have all of the same stuff that we installed on there. Not that we installed much, because of how slow it was. So we've got Windows 10, it's still horrendously slow. It's not as slow though. It's it's not quite as bad, but it but it's you know, it's okay. Do we have the Technic launcher available? Let's just double check that. Oh, the search speed is awful. We are now running this on 2 gigs of RAM though. So that's a big benefit. Uh what is this? What what? Hello? Could not load for Oh, who cares? Honestly. Right. Uh, oh, now the now the start button won't even Okay. Nope. Load. There we go. Okay, mine... What? What? I'm not even touching it now. Okay, we don't have it on here. Well, that's gonna be fun, isn't it? All right, okay, first test then. Let's see if we can get the Bedrock Edition of Minecraft running, all right? Let, let's just, um, you know, because I believe I have it installed on here from a while ago. Let's go. Hopefully this is better than it was on the, the MacBook Pro. We are using a different GPU. We're using a Intel GMA950 this time. I make that sound like a good thing. It's a huge downgrade, but it's, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Minecraft? No? Minecraft. Come on, come on, Minecraft. Come on, Minecraft. You, what are you talking about? We got. Yeah. Now, I know the other one got stuck on the, the red menu before, but we might genuinely see life. It's doing something at the bottom of the screen. I don't know. Tell me it's not opening like a million windows. I hope not. It's okay, though. C uh, oh. Oh, come on. So we've gone from it just getting stuck on the menu to completely crashing. Well, that's that's an upgrade, isn't it? Let's play some Microsoft Solitaire Collection. You know what? This is going to push this hardware to the absolute limit. It's actually, it's lagging. Did you see that? It's lagging. It is lagging on Microsoft Solitaire Collection. Ladies and gentlemen, we have done it. Windows 10 on this wasn't the main achievement. Getting Microsoft Solitaire Collection to lag was the achievement. Clond... Klondike Polar Bear. We've got Spider. We've got Free Cell. I don't know any of these games. This is just Windows XP stuff right here. How to play? No. Why is this? Do, why does this look like something off a Windows phone? G go away. Can I even drag the? Excuse me while I go and vomit. <laughs> um, it's all good. It's all good. It's just normal. It's just normal animations. <laughs> don't worry too much about it. Okay then, what do we got then? Uh, we're going to, uh, let's actually just see, you know, what hardware we're running. So we've got Task Manager. What? Th th these, these, these two things do not. Okay, there we go. Okay, Task Manager. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Here we go. Here we go. We're ramping up the CPU now. We are really benchmarking this thing now. How are we eating 88% of our two gigs? We're fortunate that the 2006 MacBook Pro survived when we were doing this with one gig. T2500, that's a solid piece of hardware. It doesn't even say that we've got a GPU. That is how powerful this is. It's so powerful that it can't even load it. All right, you know what? Let's load Steam. I spent 
hours trying to get Steam to work on the 2006 MacBook Pro. I took the SSD out of it and plugged it into the PC again and was able to install Steam and one game that you're going to love, okay? This is going to be the ultimate gaming test. You've seen Microsoft Solitaire Collection. Now you're going to see the ultimate test, okay? It's just taking 70 years to do anything. Extracting package. Extracting what? It's already on the SSD. What are you extracting, Steam? Right, well, that's doing its thing. Let's have a look at the... Uh... So this is going to be the subject of next week's video. I scored this iMac for £97. We've got a quad-core i5, 16 gigs of RAM, a one terabyte SSD, and a GT750M. This is still going. We're not even in Steam yet. We're not even on to the... Oh, we're up to uh, we're up to verifying installation. There you go. Now that, that is solid right there. That is solid. We're still, we're still going. We're just on a blank screen now, but we're still going. It's still, it's still doing its thing. The webcam's still lit up, so we're still being spied on. You know what? While this is loading, I'm just gonna... <laughs> I think we're nearly there. Library, no, 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 nothing's working. And are you ready for the ultimate gaming test on this 2006 pack? But you thought we were gonna try Halo. You thought we were gonna try Phasmophobia. You thought we were gonna try Minecraft. No, no. We are gonna try, oh yes. The most demanding title of the last decade. Why am I trying Five Nights at Freddy's? Well, I mean, A, it's the only game that we'll actually download. <laughs> within a reasonable amount of time because we get a good 200 kilobytes a second through this for some reason yeah and i think it's the only game that will actually run so that's uh, that's fun oh my goodness that is a disgustingly low frame rate for what this game is Ugh. there is an actual pause going on here i have hit new game this will probably run on windows 98 if it was compiled correctly so i don't know what is wrong with this are we are we Okay, okay, I'll give it credit. That animation was actually pretty smooth. I have to admit. Maybe maybe I shouldn't judge it too soon. First night, okay. Come on, MacBook. Oh, yes. The laggy fan. Let's just turn. Oh, okay. That is fast. Oh. Oh, wow. Okay. It can barely handle the camera static. Do we have volume? Nope. I hit the Windows key. Uh oh. Can we get to the uh, volume? Volume. Volume. Uh oh. No, no, we don't want this. No, we didn't sign up for this. So it has no sound drive, basically. To stop doing that. Oh, now we now we just have a floating red X. Brilliant. That's good. Right. Let's close this window because I feel like that's going to be bogging the system down. This actually might be the slowest piece of hardware I've ever used. Genuinely, I have never seen a computer take this long to either go back into an application or just close a window. Five Nights at Freddy's, go back into it, yes. And now we've got a loading wheel. Please! Oh no, oh I feel like, oh no. I think I've broken it by trying to turn up the volume. I've, I, genuinely I have, I actually have. It's using so many of its resources to run Five Nights at Freddy's that I can't do anything. I, I can't close a window. Uh, okay, you know what? We're just gonna... So that was a great adventure. We had loads of fun with the 2006 MacBook, didn't we? Definitely, 100%. It's it's working fine. You know, it's, uh, it's you know, uh, it's... Yeah, I mean, it's got all this sticking out the back and all that, but, you know, it's fine. And ignore the fact that the Apple logo is still on, even though I've closed it. It's, it's all good. It's all good, you know, it's perfect. Anyway, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it there because I don't actually want to kill this MacBook. So... Thank you very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed this one, please don't forget to leave it a like and subscribe to the channel. And also don't forget to join the beautiful, fantastic TechMW Discord server. We are always excited when a new person joins. So uh, maybe that could be you. I'm always on. So uh, yeah, feel free. Anyway, thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next TechMW video. See you in a bit.